Welcome, Gemini. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful um, support. Um, please like and share these videos and turn on your subscription button so that whenever um, we upload videos, you are going to be receiving it directly. All right, Gemini. So uh, some money is going to be coming in. Unexpected. It could be bonus. However, this is transpired. Could be a sort of a bonus that is coming in. All right, so let's see um, what you're coming up with. Um, some of you are dealing with an angry woman or some of your women are going to be very angry. Um, and this is going to be the two last week of August. Okay, so a whole lot of angry. Now, the connection between the two last week of August and the two first week of September, um, I see... Um, this, the, this energy of inconsistency. So whatever is happening and transpiring, I see um, that there is some inconsistency on you, Gemini part. It's as if some information um, is not um, um, consistent. That mean um, every time you speak a story, you Gemini, um, it is not adding up. Okay, so um, be aware of this because people are going to be looking at your inconsistency that is transpiring. So um, this center of this um, bi-monthly, so the two last week of August to the two first week of September is going to be having to do with some sort of an inconsistency um, that there is not clarity and this is affecting a... Um, uh, this is affecting a uh, Leo person, okay? So they're finding out that a Leo person is um, is inconsistent. That means this Leo person is not speaking the truth, okay? So be aware of this, of what is happening and transpiring. So um, there is some, some weird um, things that is going to be going on. So be on top of your game. So let's see who you're dealing with. Um, some of you could be dealing with a very, very upsetting manager or a very upset Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. Whoever this person is, uh, this person is very angry at you, um, Geminis, as to something, what you have done and some very deceptive uh, situation that you have got them in. Now, whatever the issue and the situation is, it has to do with a boss or a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. And I see this person is going to be um, 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 outrageous about what has happened and transpiring. So you have to be aware of this. So when we look at uh, um, the week of the 15, what we're seeing is that some of you are, dealing, uh, are really thinking, thinking about... Uh, um, what this person have said and why is this person so upset? Some of you are dealing with a boss and a uh, oh, and a scorpion. Okay, some of you are dealing with a boss and a scorpion, and you're thinking about a situation that is transpiring. And what we're seeing here is that you realize that uh, um, there someone has played some sort of a, a sick game okay and it could be that uh, um whatever the issue and the situation is and whoever um the this because uh, it's about the thoughts of uh, weakness and so someone has played um you know being the sick in order to win or to get out of some situation and you are dealing with a um this is definitely a Sagittarian and a Scorpion. And I see that whoever this boss is, is going to be pissed off at these two people um, because um, they now this boss is seeing exactly what is transpiring and what these two people have done um, in the department or that they're not doing their work or they have created some sort of an issue. It could be um, that these, this, this person um realize that two people have created some sort of a um um issues that um some of you will go to your boss in order to let your boss see that the scorpion and 
um, this uh, Sagittarian has created some sort of a deceptive play in order to create some issues for you um, on, on, on the work floor. So you got to be on top of your game because I see your boss is going to be coming after a Scorpion and a, um, a Sagittarian of, of, of something that they have done. Then when we look at the last week, I see some unexpected surprises is going to be coming in. Um, this unexpected surprises um, could be um, coming in. This is like your wishes and dreams, something that some of you were hoping for is going to be happening. Um, I see the energy of the rector, the lawyer is here. Some sort of an issue that was um, creating some legal issue is going to be resolved. And I see your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true, okay? So this is really wonderful and positive, especially the last week. Um, if there was some um, um, issues with your boss or supervisor, I see your wishes and dream is going to be coming in because some unexpected surprise is going to be coming in that is going to be helping you out. So I see um, some legal issue where they're going to be seeing that uh, um, your ex-boss or ex-colleague could have done some um, injustice against you. Some of you, if you had an accident on the job, you're going to be well paid out for what, um, what has transpired. So this is um, very, very, very good. So you're ending the month of August on a very, very positive note because uh, whatever the issue and the situation that was uh, um, happening and whatever that some of you were so upset about, um, this uh, resolution is going to be coming in um, because you're going to be uh, um, coming out of this situation very good. So um, be on the lookout for a um, some um, happiness with a, a legal issue or some complication that was going on is going to be re resolved. But I see like an ex-boss or your boss is going to be coming or an old colleague is going to be coming after you. So be aware. But you're in the month. Very, very positive um, um, because I see um, an unexpected luck is going to be coming in. Now, um, number 22 is a fast number and it's very good because it's duality. Um, there is the energy of uh, 10, which is an, a new start for some of you. And yes, if some of you were um, wondering if you were going to get the job or the proposal at the end of the month, it is a yes. Your wishes and dreams is going to be coming in. It's definitely a yes. So um, then I see um, whoever got sick on the job. I see some hunger in the beginning, but um, they are going to be making sure that uh, you are protected so some of you really got um had an accident on the job and that sort of a thing i see you went to the lawyers and you're going to be protected so that is good so now we're looking at the inconsistency and it's affecting because i see um as we look at the diamond shape some of you are going to be very very happy getting over a situation with a leo because they saw that the leo has been lying um, they realize that the Leo has collaborated with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person. And I see the Lord lawyers or um, um, communicating um, with each other and realizing the consistency of this individual. Okay. Whoever this individual is, there is so much inconsistency of this person. And what is happening and transpiring is that you... Um, um, Gemini's are going to be very, very happy because they're going to be seeing that whoever this person is, their information is very inconsistency. So I see the lawyers or are, 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 are managers are talking together because I see this manager is trying to get himself out of something. And they're there um, discussing that the story of this person, whoever this person is, is very inconsistent. Now, I see that uh, this person could have uh, took money that was not theirs. And I see um, that you Gemini's uh, and let's hope that you're not the person who is consistency because I see they're going to be looking at how much money was taken that was not uh, um, yours or need from someone else. So you Gemini's could be um, 
investigating a case because you could be a, a judge because I see the judge and the lawyers. I see that people are seeing that whoever this colleague is, there is something about some money because you see the judge and the judge is going to make some ruling on this person because this person information inconsistency and they're looking at the money um, that this person, it could be their account because some money went missing at the workplace or um, it could have been some loan that this person did not pay back or it could be that this lady have uh, a lot of money um, and, and it is the account department and the financial controllers that is uh, really um, investigating a situation and here the energy of the judge comes in because they realize that this lady information is uh, inconsistent. So um, whoever this lady is, it is coming up as a fire sign person. So um, again, an, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, this person is definitely coming up as a fire sign person. And I see here the controllers uh, are coming in. So it could be outside auditors um, who are coming in in order to control and people from the accounts department working together with these uh, um, um, accountant in order to find out what exactly has been happening and transpiring. Because this could be the head of the accounts department or this could be the cashier. Um, however, it is coming up in your company, this person. Um, hasn't been speaking the truth and I see some of you Gemini's this person could have tried to throw you under the bus but you Gemini's are going to be getting out so as we um, we leave the month of September uh, August going in September we see a lot of money okay so what is transpiring is that it could be the end of a book year because this is the beginning of September's the accountants, the auditors are over the floor. I see this businessman is trying to get himself out of some jam that was created by this person. He is trying to say that the problem is not his fault. Is this this person's fault? Um, so this, this man is slicked, okay? I don't know how slick he is because he's a flatterer. Um, so some of you are going to be finding out that... Uh, Maybe you have some sort of a business deal with a man and he has borrowed some money and now he's trying to flatter you out and say, you know, I don't know. I, I guess it came in, but I don't know where my accountant do, do with it or my assistant. So this man is a real flatterer and a very dis, dishonest person. So I see that a lot of you are going to be finding out uh, um, what this, who this man is and how this man behave um, doing some sort of a business because this man is not really, really um, honest and he's trying to um, throw um, the, the problem on his assistant or his accountant in order to get out of a situation because it's as if they're checking out and they're seeing that um, the figures are not correct, okay? And this man is responsible. It could be um, the um, the accountant or the financial controller and he's going to throw um, his people underneath the bus saying that he doesn't know what it, what has transpired. They are the one who sent him the document and he just signed off. So it's a very distasteful. Um, this man is a flatterer. This man um, um, just want to get out of the problem. But I see they're, they're holding him responsible and he's throwing a co-worker under the bus. So make sure that it is not you. Then um, what we're seeing is that whoever this man is, is an impeder. Okay. So when we say an impeder, this man could have got the position because he knew someone, but he doesn't really know um, the process of his job. He doesn't really know the process of his job. And I see whatever is transpiring here, they're realizing that this man is an impeder and they're checking how this man um, got this position in this company. And um, some of you kind of figured this out for a very long time, but in order to keep your job, you have never said anything. And now they're realizing and they're going to go back to investigate how this man got in this corporation and this company. It could be a man, it could be a woman. 
and um, I see people um, are going to be speaking about this because I'm seeing that the upper heads are coming in in order to look at the situation with this man and try to figure out who is this man and how does this man get this um, job position um, because they're losing a whole lot of money. Um, so it, this, whatever is happening in the company, and it doesn't really matter what department you're working in, they're going to be finding out that this man comes in as a boss, and they're trying to figure out which company, whoever, um, um, you know, who have gave him the position, because they're realizing that a whole of a lot of money was being lost. A whole lot of money has been lost. So they're going to be changing out this person and put some of you in their position or some of you could be investigating um, a situation because if you notice is that there is a sort of an investigation in the accounts department um, um, to see where the money is allocated. Okay, so um, it could be budgets uh, is being made, that sort of a thing that is transpiring. But... Um, because of something that happens uh, um, the end of August, which August, uh, some of you came out of a situation being very happy. Whatever that issue and that situation is. So I see coming in um, September, I see your boss is going to be placed on the some sort of uh, investigation or some sort of uh, um, pay. Um, you know, they're going to send him home. Or, you know, release him from his position because they realize that this man, um, his, either his documents, his paper or something, or, um, he hasn't been in control of his work. And they're going to be see that this person is an impeder. And, um, as you come to the second week, um, they're going to be investigating this person and realizing that this person is an impeder. When we talk about impeder, we're talking about people who are in the wrong position. We're talking about people who falsify documentation in order to get in a company. We're talking about people who use other people information. We're talking about people who, um, has a, a created some sort of a, um, you know, a flamingo way and uh, you know have a management position or have a supervisor position or have a position to um stir other people and don't know how to do that and i see it is an alarming um situation because they're going to be seeing that this person has given themselves a huge bonus and has been definitely um giving themselves bonuses uh, and what is now transpiring is that they're going to be realizing that this person has been skimming from the pot. And whether you're working the EG department, the IT department, whatever department you work in, you're going to be um, somehow um, get caught up in this situation. I see some of you could um, be offered some sort of an extra... Uh, extra in order to resolve this issue and this situation. So um, be aware of this, um, what is going to be coming up for you guys. So, um, ladies and gentlemen, this is the bi monthly. So please um, like and share these videos. Leave a message um, um, how this um, turns out for you. Um, this is the two last week of August and the two first weeks of September. There is some sort of an issue and... Uh, um, they're going to be finding out that your boss, your supervisor, or someone in a department is trying to throw either you or someone else on the bus because they haven't been um, doing their duties and performing their duties. I see a lot of you is, are going to be offered a bonus in order to resolve this situation. So this is wonderful. So ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you so much. Please like and share, share, share these videos. Thumbs up. Um, and I love you guys. Wishing you a wonderful month. Namaste.